So we're developing what's called a multi-rotor wind turbine. So the idea is to have lots of small rotors on one structure instead of having one giant rotor. Wind turbines are getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And that's great because it, it brings down the cost of energy. And um, so it makes wind energy cheaper. Um, but the problem is the blades are 100 meters long now. So it's, it's a really big, it's a really hard thing to manufacture and test. And um, so for us, when we want to scale up, all we need to do is just increase volume. Um, so we can use the same supply chains, the same manufacturing facilities, the same test facilities, everything. And we actually capture more energy as well. Um, so overall, we can reduce the cost of energy by about 20%. The other benefit is that we can fit all of our components on standard HGVs. Um, so we can access sites that are not feasible to access with large wind turbines. As an engineer, I've used SolidWorks for, for a number of years now. Um, and it's, it's, you know, it's the best kind of um, 3D modeling package software that you can get. Um, so I was really keen to try and bring that into, into the business. Uh, for us, we were at a really early stage of the, of the concept um, when we started using SolidWorks. And so it was really important for us to be able to assess different concepts really quickly. Um, so SolidWorks really helped us be able to model things really quickly. In particular, SolidWorks, um, the structure systems package really helped us develop models for our frame really quickly um, and assess different concepts and see which is the most viable solution. Um, so we used that quite a lot and that was really helpful and we, we also was, were able to use the built-in FEA capabilities um, to assess if they were structurally sound uh, in a really timely manner. So that really helped us develop the, the concept further. It was really quick to be able to run some simulations and get an idea of the kind of structural integrity of the systems. Um, and then from there you can build up the complexity nice and easily and, um, and you can start reducing the material that you use, making more efficient designs um, and yeah, really been able to kind of dig into the detail a little bit more. As well as that, I've uh, been able to show uh, investors and stakeholders CAD models to, to really help them visualise our concepts was really, really helpful for us as well. So I was really keen uh, to use SolidWorks within Myriad so I started looking a little bit as to what's available um, and obviously at the time we were very early stage so we didn't really have much funding and then we came across the SOLIDWORKS startup program online and um, so we applied for that it was a really easy application process and um, just answered a couple of questions and, and kind of a little bit of a pitch of what we we're trying to do and um, and then that gave us access to this really great software that we can use and at that stage in the business it was really really important for us. Yeah, I would recommend the SolidWorks startup program to other entrepreneurs. It's, it's, it's a really great asset to have. It kind of grows with you as well, so it's a really great thing. So it's not just, oh, you get started and then that's you. So it kind of, it scales up as you grow as well, which is, which is a really great feature. We're building up to, in the middle of 2024 and going into 25, we're going to start building hardware and prototype, um, which is quite expensive. So it's really, really important for us to get things right in the models first, and SolidWorks is really, really good for that.